Thank you. Wabam. We're live. It was already unmuted. Wabam. How's everyone doing? Uh, Why are you panicking when I'm asking how people are doing? I think it's the idea of people. Oh, hey, oh, oh, it's picking it up sometimes. So, this is the Sacrifier Backer Beta. Too many zerks. <laughs> uh, we have been given a heads up that there is a lot of stuff not in the demo. Uh, it's a really early look at the game. A lot of features are missing. Any feedback's appreciated. Uh, they say that I will get feedback from you all if there's anything that you think looks off, perchance. And obviously I'll have some of my own concerns, depending on how it feels. Uh, oh. Apparently it's not optimized at all. There's not really graphic settings, for instance. Yeah, see, look how responsive this is. One thing, you cannot really use the D-pad on menu. like. It reacts sometimes. Joystick. Really need the joystick. Uh, changing this doesn't actually change anything <laughs> at the moment. Simultaneously best and worst game. Feedback. My first memory is that I got phlegm in my throat. It felt like I was choking. Well, that's no bueno. That's a bad start. Uh, Cutscenes can be skipped in this. We we'll probably won't do that. There's no saving. So, you know, stuff like that. Standard, hey, this is very much a beta uh, stuff. So, with that precursor out of the way, Let's go to new game. Where there is mystery, it is generally suspected there must also be evil. That was a tofu box. Oh wow, when they say it's not optimized, they not weren't optimized. kidding. Wow. Oh, look at, the... look at those mushrooms. <laughs> look at the... This is... Did you figure out what you're going to say to him yet? Hey, I don't have to read everything out loud. Yes! Do I have to actually button prompt through? Okay. Yeah, it has the cursor. Oh, uh, yeah, I see it. It just happens to be where the 
lamp is, and that kind of obscures it a bit. Pop's never been exactly the easiest guy to talk to. It's gotten worse since, since my mom passed. Hmm. You'll work something out when you see her. Yeah, maybe. No, we should get going anyway. Remember the way to my dad's house? No. No, I don't. That's a robot. Uh, uh. <laughs> <laughs> nah, nah. In fairness, Ivanstone does look kind of funky right now. Everyone's preparing for the festival of the voyage. I heard there's gonna be some awesome folks this time around. It feels like they start decorating earlier every year. Ah, like Christmas. Of course, man. Gotta sell those souvenir ships. <laughs> ah, like Christmas. <laughs> All right, I'll mark Pops' house on your map. Stop all the clocks and go to you Zeph's house. I appreciate oh, I your faith in me, Zeph. All the clocks, it's the last name. Maybe. Uh, move Ezekiel with left stick, interact with triangle, right stick in, show tutorial. Ooh. Uh huh. Interact with objects, people with triangle. Characters with ellipses bubbles can be talked to. Around the city, you can find an open treasure chest with triangle. Try to find them all. Uh, there are apparently 17 chests hidden around the city. Finding something chest. Maybe it'd be something to do. Oh hey, person to talk to. Yeah, wow, like not optimized at all. But it's funny. Sir, can I just ask, are you Bishop Raiden? Raiden? Makes his band for him empathize with dead food. <laughs> Call me Ezekiel. Oh wow, I can't believe I'm meeting you in person. The whole church is talking about your ascension. Are the rumors true? Most of them probably are. Wow. So, the Malcora really was stolen by heretics? A heretic thief named Prometheus stole the Malcora. I saw it happen myself. I can't believe it. Don't worry, Prometheus can't hide forever. It's only a matter of time until we track him down. I understand, sir. Good luck. I thought he only stole torches. <laughs> okay. Uh, so I'm assuming the yellow bit on the map is where I'm supposed to go. Yeah. So let's go the opposite direction. <laughs> Apparently that's standard game culture. For us, at least. Oh, that's uh, these are frogs as be labor beasts. Hmm. Do -do. I am definitely going to assume that this is going to be much better optimized later. So I'm not going to harp on that too much at the moment. I already harped on it a bit. A bit, yes. That's why I'm saying not too much. You tried. Uh, I think you could have gone through the doors on the right. This one? No. That, that's not the right. I mean, it was right from where I was standing. Let's go straight right where the... Oh, at the archways? Yeah, skipped over it. This? Oh. Yeah, no, I I tried going this way. Okay. Looks like you crossed across. Uh. There's not really uh, any pop-up menus I can see. The launch distance you do up there is. Yeah, that's the assumption. Usually, games disable controls as a third roll of that. Yeah, but it was worth trying. Okay, uh, where is the magic is friend of that this item in magic? <laughs> um, the robots are probably magic. They might be. 
might be tech. Well, pr might purely be tech. It's obviously some sort of tech. Are you sure there's tech? If nothing else, it's magic tech. Well, they're robots, not purely magical beings. What's the difference between a fantasy golem and a robot? One wears metal. It could be very structurally a golem. It could be, I guess, yeah. Excuse me, your reverence. Moment of your time. What's bothering you? I'm a blacksmith, and I never saw anything like that weapon you're carrying. Can I take a closer look? Sure. This is incredible. What's it called? Does everyone in the church get one? It's a Devos. They're only issued to bishops. Thanks, Sheol. Too many of those on the market would be enough to put an honest man out of business. Well, thank you for satisfying an old man's curiosity. Have a nice day. I'm going to shrunk it down version of Dragon's Crown and the other games like it. Thama technology. <laughs> uh, Thama is... Varus. Uh, yeah, Varus. Uh, do, 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 do. Can we go further this way? My name was originally spelled without an H, but I noticed while I was, when we were talking about my name, they mentioned how some alters slightly tweak the spelling so that the pronunciation is clear. Ah, yes, like Syra. <laughs> no, it's Kira. Um, <laughs> so... <laughs> was I wrong? I haven't met her yet. It is pronounced Kira. Oh. I'm joking about tweaking the, pronun tweaking the spelling so pronunciation is clear when her spelling makes it very not clear. Well, you've been doing this joke since I met you. Why would I expect anything different? Yeah, good observation. Oh. That's invisible wall there, okay. Um. So. Hmm. Oh, we're actually getting close to. The map is interesting. It doesn't show, like, buildings or anything, just kind of a general location of stuff. Today's catch. Yeah, today's catch straight from the Artisa Canal. I can speak. Artisa Canal. Yeah, I haven't been talking to necessarily all of them. Just the ones that are at your interest. Oh, what's that lying there? Oh, I want to pet it. Let me pet it. Might be dangerous. Let me pet it. <laughs> Hey, look at that. That's what we're looking for. Secret found, one of 17. Yeah. Uh, well, if that person was sitting right there, I think they might have interested today. I can go back and talk to them. Yeah, considering they were near that chest. I don't think proximity to a chest is actually going to be relevant. Probably not, but... Hope something bites soon. Someone. So it's like the first person who's near a chest might say like, "Oh, and there's uh, those interesting boxes. Maybe something something interesting." <laughs> Sometimes people do that with games. True enough. Um, but yeah. It looks like there was something. Oh, oh. yeah. Is that what I saw? Go, go further back. And to the left side. Hello there. General Kenobi. Uh, just keep going. Uh, forward and left. Ah, oh, nice catch. Could have just said go around the left side of the building. 
still getting rhythm. I see you're one of the quieter ones. <laughs> eh. Getting the rhythm of voice too. She might be very talkative later. Have you had experiences with that? I would have been able to see it from here. Because I definitely would have poked over here just to... Huh. Speaking of seeing... Um... But yeah. So, because of that, I tweaked my spell. To add the H. It was originally spelled without the H. Do you think my age was necessary? I could still change it. Meh. Indifferent. I mean, volume level. Not as in adjust the volume, just that you talk softly. I'm not sure I trust that salesman. Huh, okay. Well. There was a dot 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 you passed by and I wonder if it might have been one of the- oh. See anything you like you- that. Ah, see anything you like, your reverence. 20% church discount, and that's cutting my own throat. <laughs> I said your throat. Wait, what? I said 20% discount, that's cutting your own throat. Oh. Okay, so, uh, talking to him multiple times can give different lines. I should have tried that before. We've got star milk, festival stew, roast feg, bodmer bream, jabber codfish, cavern fruit, waterberries, farinata biscuits, cave bean, th that eat, mm. I'm going to assume it's just, they don't have it in a standardized uh, typeface yet, because the E with the accent is very definitely different. Cave beans. That typeface may distinguish these with accents. It might. Um. And wigs made from the finest mullet hair. Why are you trying to kill the software? Is that easier to delete them? We've got freshly caught fish from the Artisa Canal, freshly baked cakes from Scala Piera. Pieria. Freshly scraped lichen from Tundale and freshly aged wine from Riverroll. Freshly aged wine. Everything's fresh here, sir. We've got eggs so fresh the flugel what laid them ain't even been born yet. <laughs> Impressive. That's uh, pretty fresh. Now, see? See anything like your reverence? 20% church discount, and that's cutting my own throat. Oh. So it does eventually get back to. The original line. That hurts. It's lagging. It. Oh, Discord's lagging. Oh. Uh, cutting your own throat is like cutthroat prices, where you're getting as close to, or you're making very little profit off of it in order to actually make a sale at all. Excuse me, sir. Can I ask something? What's bothering you? I just heard the Divine Mother's proclamation about heresy. The idea that there are demon people walking around in the city, it scares me a little. We're all scared, priestess. But you're a bishop. Yes, and if I wasn't scared, I'd be a very stupid one. The heretics are real, and they're here among us. He said the thing. Anyone who isn't scared is an idiot. Well... So, <laughs> so what can I do? The same as me. Fight heresy however you can. It's the only way Antioch will ever be free from it. I'm not a soldier, sir. You don't need to be. Everyone can fight heresy in their own way. Even if you're just comforting the civilians who are panicking or praying to Sheol. It it all helps. There's a character in the Discord series. He huh. seems like he has a... Oh. I don't know if it was a reference there. I was explaining the cutthroat thing to Varys. Because she was asking why would you cut your own throat. Yes, sir. Thank you. Heresy by the Emperor. Must be purged. Yay, we're up to 6 of 17 secrets. I do want to poke around a lot of the city before continuing. 
the story if possible just that's how i typically play stuff anyways and there's secrets is this back where we started i think this is back where we started yeah yeah so it is okay I guess it's time to continue. I just got pet for the first time in Stray. Yay. <laughs> That's good. I like the soundtrack so far. It's relaxing. So yeah, no major qualms outside the obvious yet. Feels weird to be back. <laughs> How long's it been? The last time I came here was uh, a couple months before the ascension. A little while after mom passed. Voice acting feels very natural. Mm hmm. I kept meaning to visit, but, you know, church stuff. <laughs> For me, it was that day of the voyage feast your mother invited me to. Five, no, six years ago. Yeah, that was a good meal, though, wasn't it? Ma was a hell of a cook. Only downside was I remember my sisters wouldn't shut up asking you questions the whole damn time. <laughs> it feel yeah, like you're saying, it feels like natural dialogue instead of curated, in a way. They were curious, I guess. Curious is the word I'd use easy, all right? They spent a solid year afterwards trying to get me to invite you back. <laughs> Come on, let's go inside. The pauses feel natural, in my opinion. After I was a uh, form of the uh, such a sword. Okay, so that's the uh, transforming weapon, like a rod. That's what it seems to be, yeah. This place looks like a mullet junkyard. Ugh. My sister said it was bad, but... So, they don't live here anymore? Moved out a while ago. Now the only one who lives here is my dad. Hey, Pop! What's hey, with Jules. the mess? I think I hear a wheel spinning upstairs. He's probably inside. Do you want to wait for him to come out? That could be hours. <laughs> longer. Let's just go in and find him. Into Erebus? I don't know if we should disturb him while he's praying. We need to do something. How would we even track him down? Shale will guide us to him. I spoke to him about this easy. About how Pop has been spending all his time in Erebus and... And I think he'll help us. Hmm. I think Shell might be the god. That's what it seems to be. Do you have another couple of wheels we can use? Nah, this place is a one-wheeler. We weren't rich enough for more. There are some public wheels in the square, though. Hmm. That must be that there. room with the robot. Yeah. All right, can pray let's there. go. What? Prayer with a tangible effect? This will be a game that Peon will either be judgmental of or like. What's happening? Uh, I sure hope the combat isn't real time with this lag, right? Though it's very in close space, it seems. Yeah, it might just be that the city is. Ah, the city just has like so many things going on. There's a lot of sprites and animations, so if a game's not optimized well. Oh, you, you manually, so you could actually read the... Oh, I uh, didn't think I hit it last time. <laughs> uh, so let's see. There's been no king or queen in Antioch since 221 MN, over 350 years before the events of Sacrifier. Nowadays, justice has made it out by the Council of Antioch, a group of 20 nobles responsible for crime and punishment. Each member of the council represents a district of Antioch. The council is second in power only to the Church of Shale. Uh, I think... Yeah, and okay, so both like this. 
uh what's happening is we went to find uh zeke's father zeke 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 i'm a man's father. Yeah. And apparently he is uh, in Erebus via wheel spinning. We, we try to spread out, yes. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, this is the place. He's been lost in prayer for a lot of time. Zephaniah. I guess we're ready. I was getting his name combined with Ezekiel, who is your character. We were looking for Zephaniah's father. Look at the wheels that are in use, ours, Benny. Mm hmm. Hmm. Maybe that's why they're called wheels. Antioch is in the Bible. And he's praying. Yeah, apparently the wheel spinning is prayer rooms, I would assume, because it looks like they get in. The Diva of Scotland is a weapon created by the Church of Sheol, bestowed only upon the most elite soldiers, the bishops. Oh, so it looks like some of them are. Some are. Some are. Hmm. Uh, that's, I get the impression that when you enter prayer, you enter a VR environment. <laughs> As such? As such. I'm glad I managed to get out what I said first. Uh, there's still a bit of lag. I guess they threw in biblical ter terms and names to make the nature of it being a faith-based game more authentic. I came here to visit my parents. The spirits only visit Erebus briefly, just like we do. Hmm. It looks like this is like a low heaven of some sort. Seems to be. <laughs> oh, the face. Hmm. Uh, I don't think we can transpose time smoothly. Was that a joke? Uh, have to go up You know, I think I can see other sphere. <laughs> uh, wouldn't you say it looks kind of like Triangle Strategy 2? A bit, yeah. I could definitely see Triangle Strategy in it. There's a lot of games it could potentially remind someone of. Yeah. And who, pray tell, are you? No, no pun intended on that. Why didn't you? Why didn't I intend the pun? Yeah. Because if I intend a pun, I'm going to acknowledge I intended the pun. Is everything all right? They say that heresy has returned to Antioch. Is it true? It's true. Grr. What's the matter? Did you ever hear of the Farinata Peaks disaster? Perhaps you're too young. It's been 64 years. I think so. You mean those sky carriages? Yes, that night when the sky carriage cable snapped. Oh, that can't be good. Eight carriages fell between Farinata Peaks and Noihu? Straight into the sorrow. Nobody survived, of course. 27 civilians dead. Okay. I was one of them. I'm sorry. Everyone called it a tragedy, a freak accident, but there was nothing accidental about it. Heretics attacked those carriages. Heretics? I never heard anything about that. Why did they... One of the carriages was holding a group of church bigwigs. Their deaths were a direct attack on Sheol. And the rest of us were just... collateral. That's terrible. Why don't people talk about it? You're a bishop. You don't know? The church hushes it up? Always. After the heretics responsible were caught, the whole affair was swept under the rug, like it never happened. That doesn't seem right. They probably wanted to stop people from panicking. It's maddening. People deserve to know. But 
this time they've gone public about their yeah about the heretic threat. The appeal is so yes, the Divine Mother has issued a proclamation. That can only mean one thing. What? The current outbreak is so big that even Sheol is panicking. You'll fight the heretics, I suppose? I will. Good. We have a perfect world, and the heretics want to tear it all down. Make them pay. So, it uh, looks like you can contact those who have the keys. Which is probably why uh, Zeph's father is in Erebus so much. Probably wants to see his wife. Zeph's mom. Hmm. Time to chart, purge the church along with the heretics. Yeah, I can definitely see this getting a very deep story on both fronts. Yeah. Uh, I think that very much. Hear this prayer, O oh Shale. Shale. <laughs> Grant me your sight. Grant me your goodness. Grant me your wisdom. Show me the way to my father who is lost. <laughs> hmm. All right, let's go. Reach Jiraiya's glade. Uh, hey, I can't come over this way. Hmm. All right. Oh. Okay, just interact. Oh, overworld. Yeah, I'm liking it. Dindron, dry as glade, Ivan Stone. Is Ivanstone the city we were in? It probably is. Okay, because Dindron or Dindrion is Varus muted or far away? I was muted. She was muted. Oh no, you did, did you, you get all the talk, talk about the uh, name stuff? <laughs> I think the only substantial things I talked about otherwise was that Peon would like this game. <laughs> and Pian and the Chaos Clan, the nobles were brought up. Dry as Oh, this is so much smoother. Oh, hey, jumping. Jump a double jump with X. Instantly kill stuff with square to avoid battles. Ow! Oh. Uh, there's a little bit of lag if I'm messing around too much. I get asked that a lot. The H is before the S. No. This will be the first time I've interacted with any of you. Even though I left a message in quotes, I didn't really talk. Okay. Can't actually break that wall. Yeah, no. I haven't. Pick keys up and transfer them to obelisks to unlock new hidden paths. Okay. Uh, oh, yeah, I mentioned that the, those wheels were spinning. That's probably why they were called the wheels. Yeah. I mentioned it's a uh, VR environment before <laughs> the actual place shown. I know it's not literally like a digital world. It's, as I said, it. It's. I get the impression it's some kind of lower heaven. It's consider so you considering it's prayer based and everything, and then that it's probably a. Uh, and just noted the ghosts. So you can't actually just hang there. If you grab on, you automatically climb up. Uh, I think that covered everything. Oh, right stick does control camera. It looks like you get multiple tools. The square is... Yeah. Let's end Oh, there is a ledge there. Yeah, that's, that's another, another message you missed. Uh, I think that might be the last message you missed. Wait. Um, because I remarked how 
Theon got interested in this game, but we can't get alters to focus on trying out Duel Master. <laughs> so it looks oh. like a real time combat. He sure does, huh? So you have a glaive, a hammer, and a sword. Dodge on cooldown. Okay. Oh, you choose which one you want to use and then select who you want to hit. Oh, wait, no. And while you're in it, you can actually switch which weapon you want to use. So, let's sort... Okay, if I'm attacking this one, the glaive seems to have the best... Do I hit the same button again? Yes. Oh, hit him in rhythm to execute a combo. Oh, hit the button as you're hitting. Uh, like as the weapon is hitting. Looks like the battle soundtrack hasn't been implemented yet. They probably need to... Huh. Okay, let's try the hammer. Looks, Looks like, like you have multiple, multiple options. I don't know... Maybe I'm just blind on what I should be hitting it in sync with. I'll try to look out for it. Is it that yellow bar at the bottom? No, because that's just AP, it seems like. Yeah. Uh, let's try the sword. Just mashing it seems to work, I guess? Because you had a lot of AP built up. Oh, okay, that's why it was giving me extra attacks. So, if you wait, you can just get a lot of attacks in at once. Basically, you're not given opportunity cost issues. That's appreciated. Interesting. You can see when the enemies are about to attack. Yeah. It seems like it's going to be a little hard to get enemies with no attack. So, oh, it looks like you switch between the weapons you're attacking with as you press the oh. different inputs. Oh, okay. So that just lets you charge AP up faster. Oh. Oh. As you attack more frequently, dots come up on the icons. That might be important. Looks huh. like Final Head doesn't give a dot. Interesting. Does that have damage rolls? I've been busy paying attention to the lower parts of the ah. interface. Does it have what? Variable damage. Uh, it seems like different weapons do. So like you can see up at the top right, minus 40% while I have the sword selected. Then that's the hammer and that's the glaive. Okay, so starts and weapons will have better effectiveness. Yeah. Bonk. Bonk. Not enough action points. Oh! Oh, so to... that's why the dots keep adding. The more you use a single weapon, the more action points using that weapon costs. Okay. Okay. EXP and Lux. Okay. Figuring it out a little bit. <gasps> Heresy has taken over Erebus easy. It's crazy. I worry about my dad spending so much time in here. 
He can't die inside Erebus, Zeph. Remember the trial of the body? Yeah, but he could probably still get infected by heresy or some shit. Who knows? Come on, let's keep going. So defense is very much real time. Is that a uh, checkpoint or something? You are on. <laughs> so Mexa is real time, man. Uh, no, we need keys to activate the obelisk. Like oh. that thing over there. Okay. So yeah, defense is real time, but offense is more strategy, turn-based-ish. Bonk. Oh. Bonk. Bonk. They get one-liners when they attack. <laughs> uh... I'm assuming I'm gonna have to go right and then come back. You're here. That you're, bottom you're, one. You're sounding a lot like Pian. <laughs> ah. Oh. What you deserve. Okay, though. So knowing that. Raise your weapon. I take it the R101 is selecting different characters to attack? Oh! Starters and finishers! Oh! So, you see it where it's under the 52 it says starters? Yeah, yeah. Finishers. Uh -huh. Oh. Looks like you can't switch between finishers. Or you can't switch between star and finisher. Hmm. Seems that way. You get away from me. It could be that the finishers are the follow-up attack, so... Oh, let's try. wait. Oh, that's a bomb. I can't actually switch right now, but if I'm at seven... Oh, no. Okay. <laughs> bomb. I can't tell I... if I actually roll dodge that or not. It looks like... No, no I did not. <laughs> Huh. Interesting. Okay, so HP carries over. Uh, insta-kills like that don't help for HP. That does. Yay, we got a key! We're gonna take it backwards. Oh, I could use this one. But I want to see what's over at that other, the first one. That we came across. Interesting game so far. It's the oh, divers blast. Divers blast. Uh, it seems fluid enough. Not taking the lag into account because I'm sure that'll be fine on actual release. It's what's in real time aspects, but then it makes sure that. You have time to think when you're trying to actually act. Yeah. <clears throat> we very much like the idea of a hybrid system like this. Oh. Hey. Wait, so that used up my key. Hmm. Hmm. I'm going to eat more of my food. All right. Real time, Bola. Echoes or messages left in there. Yeah, like I could cycle through that one, but that was. It forced me to continue. Okay. You know what? Let's fight this one again. So I can see what those finishers are like. Hmm. Okay, you can hit circle, which is the dodge button, to cancel out of an attack if you accidentally hit it. So if I do... nope. So what if I do finishers? I have no time for this.
Is it because I was hitting buttons? Oh, that's on cooldown now. Oh, no. Target out of range. Not enough tension. <laughs> Looks like you evaded it. <coughs> How do you build tension then? Huh. Maybe just doing normal starter. Oh. Doing starters probably built up tension. Oh, the meter in the middle is down to zero. Oh, yeah. That's tension. Okay. Yep, that makes sense. Uh... Okay, so you can just keep mixing different weapons in as long as you have uh, action points. Target out of range. Is it because he's in the train still? Oh, maybe. <laughs> oh no, he looks like he's stuck. I feel angry. Victory. Oh. I wonder if it disables the sight to outbound. Huh. What's this I hear? Something about recipes with fresh local ingredients. <laughs> Uh, yeah, so we did actually do up one of the recipes today. It was the, uh, boo, boo, I have the recipe card in the other room. It was, uh, pulled pork wraps, basically. Power. And they weren't too bad to put together. Don't hit buttons, that's how you end up eating in a move. You can block and get in combo. Let's wait until they're minus on block. Okay, Act different battlefield. You can actually block. I don't know how much it re Oh, holding block uh, costs action points. Slowly drains your bar. Fancy. Okay, it's simple enough combat. The battle system vaguely reminds me of. Uh, is this supposed to be Rouge Galaxy or Rogue Galaxy? Rouge Galaxy. Uh, something, something, use my code, Pogsy11056. Hello, Fresh. Bonk. <laughs> Go to horny jail. You won't win. <laughs> Already up to twelve of seventeen secrets. And if they're spread all throughout like this, and we're up to twelve already, then yeah, this really isn't that long of a game. Perfect. Hey. Maybe they're all supposed to start, but yeah, more likely. Okay. Bonk. Nope, nope, nope. You get away from me. Nope, I see that laser. Let's start with speed. Oh. Then 
what if I go spear? Hammer combo to go for the end. At least it's fun combo paths, mix and match. Uh, how you want to start off. Not enough keys. Do I actually have to leave and come back to get the keys again? Is that the cost of getting the secrets? Hmm. Oh, reload scene. I don't know. Also, there's a special debug feature. It makes me super awesome and able to do anything. And you can just hit pause and go to win battle. <laughs> Pick keys up and transfer them to Obelisk. Oh, you can just take them out of Obelisk. Okay. Well, if you're done using a key, why don't you just take it back? That's why they had that one key at that other one. Yeah. Because otherwise it's kind of silly, isn't it? Yeah, I mean, that makes sense. Okay, that that makes a lot more sense now. I like it. I'm just dumb. <laughs> Okay, so it's not permanently using up keys. I should have picked on that that out myself. Hey, we know better now. Okay, what's the next finisher to see? Sword or hammer? Uh go hammer. I've no time for this. That's very zoomed back. Oh. It is gone. So if a finisher hits, it's very powerful. It's a well, finisher. finisher. Yeah. Ooh. Oh, I don't. Also, so you can go into that even if you don't have enough. Oh, jeez, get away from me. Uh, hi, Jules, Drake, and Lion, by the way. Oh, that's bad. And Jack. Does he go by Jack or Paddlin? I keep calling him Jack on stream. Oh, healing. Because I made a mistake before. Oh, that does damn. Oh. Shh, I'm, I'm bad. It's the fire left from an explosion. I saw a fancy number and I didn't exactly hear a damaging sound, so. Yeah, I'm pretty sure it's this one. Oh, it opens that side as well. Okay. Wait, you didn't get the obelisk key back? Oh, I guess I could get it back, couldn't I? I'm gonna have to remember to do that. Oh, this side stays open? Oh, okay. No, no. I see. Yeah, we got down here before. You saw how earlier it closed up the passageways. Yeah, that's why it surprised me. I didn't realize that stayed open. You've been flanked. Given you didn't know what to call me, who do I have? 
Varus. Prepare yourself. Yeah. You, you don't have, have any points to act with. Good to know that, that you can uh, check your range and stuff by doing that. I need to learn to give it a moment to start the explosion before rolling away. Or you can kill it first. Well, sure. But... It's just spear, 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 spear. Be sure to time your hits so that you get those perfects. What am I supposed to time them on, though? I Probably. still don't know. That's the issue. That's why I've just kind of been mashing it. Is a uh, very thing unusual, or...? Oh. <laughs> All right. There he was uh, slaying for gay, wasn't it? Uh, I think so. Yeah. Hey, look, I'm all healed up. Then let's do the full sword combo. I remember the parents saying that trans is gay, so am I ultra deluxe gay? You can be gay well, if you want to be. saying that's not how that works. It's not how it works. Uh, you know what? Do I have enough? Sword finisher. Oh! Simple, but effective. Okay. Hmm. Might be able to double jump that. Oh yeah, you can barely reach. I didn't think you would. All right. Oh. Also, another thing is that. Oh, this is a restore. Oh no, this is the restore. <laughs> um. That's a story beat. So. I wanted to say something I forgot. Ah, you'll think of it. During the Ascension, newly trained novices traditionally make their vow to protect Antioch in front of the Malkora. Okay, what is that? <laughs> foul of form, foul of face, creatures of Anion. Behold, beware the demon race, children of a Maimon. Huh. Uh, my mon is probably a devil-like figure in their faith. Turn for scripture, easy. Let's chop it into itty bitty pieces first. We can recite poetry about it later. <laughs> <laughs> I kind of like the uh, prerogative uh, that Zeph does. does. Yeah. Do I have to roll immediately? Okay, no. No, you're not gay. You're a transformer girly in disguise. <laughs> Oh, the... Your salvation. The... Oh. I had a marking about the god figure as well as the deep devil figure. Oh. Uh... Okay, so that hurts even rolling through it. Might have invisibility frames towards the start, like in Monster Hunter. Okay. Bonk. Uh, I probably want to stay out of these. Yeah. Ow. That hit me from there. Huh. Okay. Um. Oh. 
You really know your stuff, don't you? What's up? Oh, lion referring to Amon. That's doing no damage. Yep. I couldn't tell which one I was targeted on at first. Probably an obvious indicator up at the top. You probably need to destroy the minions before you can attack it. Yeah, I wasn't trying to attack him. I still want to make that observation. <laughs> it's boss time! No, it's boss time. Oh, it's not the more of a single weapon you use, just the more you use in general. Okay. Costs more. So, if you want to get really good at battling, you need to watch how weapons escalate. Yeah. Okay. But the damage might vary based on which specific attack. Yeah, so learning which combo to use is probably... Also, with a targeting thing, where if you're not being sure, you could pay attention to which one you're targeting on top. Yeah, that's what I was saying. There's probably something obvious I was just being dumb about before. Yeah, okay. just remember the boss's name. That way you won't actually target him. Huh. Huh. Which one do I want to attack? Ah, the one on the far left. Oh, it's out of range. I guess I'll hit this one. Charge that back up. Charge that back up. Why is it stuck at six of seven? Can I hit you? No! Can you possibly attack it now? That's why. Be careful, it looks like that's a thorns. Yeah, that's why I'm trying to stay out of it. Okay. Then finisher. To be oh. honest, I forgot the context oh, check. Oh, range. Uh, I'm gonna go cool. spear finisher. Okay. No. Die. <laughs> he had three health. Oh. Hey. That wasn't bad at all. Okay. Ezekiel and other bishops can break Erebus locks by traveling to the... Sp okay. Good fight. Good fight. <laughs> <laughs> the demons do seem to be getting stronger. Or Why does Zephaniah feel out of breath? Every day. You think about that? Ha! Huh. Zeph seemed very out of breath, and Ezekiel was just like, huh, yeah, that was a thing. <laughs> I, like I like how they, they bounce, bounce off each, each other. other. Yeah, it's a great dynamic. Oh, hold up, I, I think I could see someone ahead. Dibs on Zephaniah. <laughs> hey, Pop! I get to be the Zeph of the two of us. Oh, oh dear. <laughs> no, I don't think I have that level of energy. Oh, you're here. <laughs> and there's oh, Ma. His mother. Yeah. You're with Ma. <sighs> Zephaniah, what are you doing here, boy? What are you doing here? It's so good to see you, Zephaniah. Are you all right, Ma? The demons didn't attack you? We keep our distance. They don't bother us, do they, dear? No, we're fine. Hmm. All right, uh, good. But why are you still here, Ma? I, I, I don't understand. You ought to be on your final voyage by now. We said goodbye to you. 
I didn't start my final voyage yet. Hmm. What? Zeph, I think they're soul linked. Boys, this is a private matter. <laughs> if you want to go wait for me outside the wheel, we ain't going anywhere. I can't Only believe my feet. how grown up you look, Seth and Naya, in your bishop's robes. I was. I don't so know if that's a negative thing or just ascension. an incidental thing. Huh. It's cool, Ma. You were dead. <laughs> the ceremony didn't go so smoothly anyway, Mrs. Milto. Ezekiel, where are my manners? It's nice to see you again. Likewise, I was so sorry to hear about your passing. You say as you're talking to her directly. To be fair, she is dead. Yeah, this is just going to be awkward with statements like that. Shale decided it was my time. I drink. I can't complain. I had a good life. Mrs. Milto, might Zephaniah and I have a moment to speak to Jiraiya alone? Of course. Martha. Oop, Jiraiya, she vanished. how often does Martha visit you here? Oh, I don't see her all that much. Mullig shit. You watch your tongue, young man. <laughs> You've been spending all your time in here ever since she died. Now I see why. At first she would just come by for a couple of minutes every day. Just to check how I was doing. Ask after the girls. But it gets harder and harder to say goodbye. Did you re-enable booping you? No. But, but you're, you're off, off camera. camera. Oh, that's unfortunate, huh? I guess you can get some free ones in. Jewel said she wanted to redeem booping me. Just be careful with your dr drink. This is selfish, Pop. You gotta let Ma go her own way. Your son's right, Mr. Milto. A soul in Erebus should not linger too long before beginning its final voyage. Don't I drink while boop nicks. <laughs> and why not? We ain't doing any harm to anyone. Erebus is the bridge between Antioch and Shale. You and Martha are both running toward a world which is not your own. <sighs> Jariah, you have a family in Antioch who miss you. You need to eat, to work, to live. It's not healthy for your body or your mind to spend all your time here. Hmm. And as for Martha... Shale teaches that death is only the beginning of the final voyage to Shale, Mr. Milto. Erebus is part of the journey, but there's more. There are things that the living cannot understand. As long as Martha stays here with you, she can't experience them. I wonder how religious I'm this just, is going to get. Like, there's, I'm, it's I'm ready obvious it's going to get very much so, considering this is, you know... You're part of the church and all of the yeah. spiritual overtones, not undertones. Oh, no. Spiritual overtones in everything going on so far. This isn't the end. You will never lose your wife completely. Her soul will still come back to visit from time to time once she has completed her final voyage. How often? Once every few months? Less and less over time. That's how it goes. This isn't fair. I still love her. I know. That's mm. why you have to let her go. What about her back? Pop, we need you at Antioch. I need you. Beth and Dinah need you. We just lost Ma. We ain't ready to lose you too. <laughs> hmm. Jariah, there is a passage of the word which was of some comfort to me when my parents pass. Every song must end in time. Each fiddler must lay down their bow and rest a while. Only then, after the echoes of the crowd's applause have faded into silence, can music begin anew. Hmm. I know what you're trying to say. 
It's not the same song, though, is it? No, it isn't. But that doesn't mean it can't be beautiful. Can I have just a little more time with her? Just to say goodbye? Of course. Bye, Papa. No, you have to come with us immediately. Right? Nah. What do you think? Nah, he's Jerome probably not all right. Better for this, Seth. With time, he can finally begin to heal. Yeah, but I don't know. Maybe he has a point. I mean, I haven't been visiting as often as I should. You've been busy with the outbreak. Yeah, but that won't change. I don't have time to be coming around every day, not now that I'm a bishop. It's gonna be all alone in that big old house. <laughs> Too much emotions and sappiness. <laughs> maybe, maybe it would be better if Ma stays here with him. He loved her so much. There's a reason the church warns against becoming soul linked, Zeph. Jiraiya's wasting away inside Erebus. And Martha can't reach Sheol until she begins her final voyage. They'll be together forever one day, Zeph. It's just not that time yet. You're right. It has to be this way, I guess. Yeah, I agree with that, Jack. If you do believe I'm in a place like... Seth. I'm beginning my final voyage. If you do believe in a place like heaven, then being upset that someone is going there, yeah, it's kind of selfish. I think you're right. It will be kinder on everyone in the long run. I'll miss you, Ma. I'll be back someday. Until then. Remember that I love you. Hmm. She's gone. For real this time. I don't know. Shale is... It sounds like... A powerful deity that they pray to. Because they have mentioned praying to Shale. And she's going on her final voyage to Shale. So I don't I know what's really right know. Thing to do, but this this must be so hard for my dad. And there's mentions of her being able to come back to visit occasionally, but that sounds different than what she's doing now, which is just not starting the final voyage and just staying here. It's kind of like how in real life people report that the. Uh, that they that they've seen loved ones in dreams or in movements moments of grief so i'm thinking this may be a variation of that type of experience yeah where because those loved ones are assumedly departed to the afterlife of a faith right presumably yeah the shale afterlife might be different from heaven. I yeah. I don't know if there is a place that they consider heaven is the thing. Like, I don't know enough about the lore of this world at the moment. What I know is that they pray to shale and the departed will need to go on their final voyage to shale. Yeah. When we say heaven, godly figure, the, the uh, full figure and things like that, we aren't being li literal. We are just using familiar slang. Uh, I'm using it as a familiar slang because shell afterlife is probably a lot grayer and they different than what Christians think of heaven. Right. So it gets some general afterlife. Why don't we talk to your sisters when we get back to Antioch? Between the four of us, I'm sure we can make sure Jiraiya has some company every day. You mean that you'd come visit him? Of course. Come on, we should take Jiraiya home. Yeah. One thing's for sure, 
I'm going to fix that house up while I'm here. <laughs> the place is a mess. You shouldn't be living like that. I'll help. Do you think the divas turns into a broom? <laughs> <laughs> Let's find out. And maybe we can invite Beth and Dinah around after we're done. I'll have dinner together. I'd like that. All right, then. <laughs> uh, hey, easy. Thank you for all this. I, I really mean it. Stuff is still messed up, but now I feel like maybe we'll be able to fix it. Right, Green Shell. <laughs> <laughs> hmm. Aw, look at everyone getting that cleaned up. I like how they actually have the little montage scene of the people actually so, doing stuff. Uh, is <laughs> Zephaniah going to be alright? He reported what happened. Ah, motions, they burn. Yes, sir. I think they'll be okay now. Glad to hear it. It's a good thing you did, helping your brother Bishop out. It was my duty. It was your choice, and it was a good choice, an important choice. Being a bishop ain't easy. That's not what Zephaniah the text says. Today. One day you'll find out the same thing. It says being a bishop isn't. Oh. Yeah. I, I I need to, I need to drop everything. File a report. <laughs> no. I made one note. The AP glitch and that's all. Uh, Is there anything else? I, we... I think the AP thing. Uh. Oh, actually the opposite. Known issues. There's a rare bug that can sometimes occur during a battle that results in Ezekiel getting stuck with more action points than is possible. This will lead to a soft lock. <laughs> yeah, not having less. And that was fixed after spending some and going back. It might have just been a visual thing. But yeah, it's worth having a note. It takes a toll in ways you can't imagine. It's the bonds you form with your new brothers and sisters that will help you see it through. Be there for your brother, Ezekiel, whenever he needs you. And I know he'll be there for you when the time comes. Yes, sir, I will. <laughs> Good, now get back to work. Hmm. Oh. Good, good first impressions. impressions. Good first impressions, yeah. This is actually a good quest to actually do. You get a feel for the city. You get good ideas of how the characters interact. Then you see the the kind of mapping system. The then you can see the way the world map works. Uh, get, get some ideas of the basic lore uh, the game operates on. You get a and good feel for a variety of the systems, both gameplay and story. Yeah. You definitely get to see how the combat system works. You get like six battles across the field and the boss. And you can see that you could basically do a backstab kind of thing to skip battles. Wait, and it also gives an indicator that you'll probably have other overworld actions, like was pointed out. It specifically says square for the backstab. So do triangle and circle do anything in overworld at some point? Probably. Well, triangles uh, interact as oh, no, probably you're right. square and circle. True. Right? Or it might be you can cycle through and square is just your general overworld action button. Yeah. It's also possible that it's just a reminder tool to and you don't get anything else. Exploration. Yeah, uh, Devo's Blast, okay. But it does say that with specify with this demo, it might be saying Devo's Blast specifically because we're on demo. Maybe. There's a lot we don't know. <laughs> so 
switch skill category, guard, AP charge, first, second, third, dodge, cancel. Those are going to be more than starters and finishers? Maybe? Because... Pause menu. Huh. Yeah. So, yeah, that was the uh, Sacrifier Backer demo. Uh, I don't know if there was anything in particular you all, <laughs> a PS5 controller, rip. I don't know if there's anything you all wanted to see in particular that we could potentially show that we didn't happen to show. Cause I feel like we tried pretty much everything. The only thing we didn't do is find all 17 chests. We were missing three of them. They must be really all well hidden. There, there might be a couple in the actual house after you have a scene. I doubt it, but... Mmm, maybe. But... Yeah, that's... It's a solid demonstration of the game. And it looks like a solid game. Yeah. So... You didn't crash the game. <laughs> uh... Yeah, I gave a heads up this might be a short stream because I didn't know how long the demo was. Apparently, it's about an hour long. Hmm. Do we want to switch the stream mode to just chatting and talk about things? Because we have been doing a, a lot of changes have happened in the system and just quickly reviewing it. I feel like that'd probably be better off just in Discord where you can have things listed out that okay. seem you all seem a lot better about communicating that way okay no clip the game today we, mo we <laughs> might we might free chat stream or not probably not the only reason i could think that might go into free chat stream anyways is if we end up having uh mapping out and hmm but it probably will end up in discord otherwise and yeah so, because I remember hearing Vola saying something about wanting to try to see if she could find out anything about why we keep on having surges of altars. Hmm. Because they all have their own different circumstances. I think most of the surges, like mine, have been caught. Uh, uh, have been from different angles but still worth looking into apparently but yeah uh thanks for tuning in everyone we'll be back with mega man tomorrow for normal stream stuff yeah that's that's a benefit so we're done confirm what you want to say. The, the stream does all stream format does also mean that most of uh, people who are in the chat will be focused on the chat enough that it'll be easier to converse. <laughs> but voice chat might actually be the best format. Yeah, we're just we're just going to have it in voice chat format. So, all right. I hope you all have a wonderful day. Yeah. Uh, hopefully we'll see you tomorrow for more Mega Man. Seems like we're getting somewhere. Maybe we'll only have to run across the game two or three more times. <laughs> <laughs> Trip around the world. Woo. Yeah, that is... This is a great game. We look for... This is almost... If it's not outright um, a streamer choice, it will at least be on the polls when it releases. Oh, for sure. Uh, and as said, as far as this demo is concerned, there are a lot of features that are missing at the moment. So there will be a lot more than this. So, yeah, it'll be fun to see. Anyways, have a good one, everybody.